Hello everybody. I wanted to share some of my experiences with Linux Mint 18.3 with you. First of all, I turned my Linux Mint into Windows XP. <laughs> Not really. What this is, is an actual theme that uh, you can put on the uh, Linux Mint desktop. So what I did was I went in and uh, added the theme with uh, Windows XP which I thought was quite amusing. Let's see where it, here it is right there. Mint XP. So anyway I went in and uh, installed the Windows. I, I of course had to go and uh, get the uh, the bliss background I went and pulled that off of uh, the internet and just dropped it in but what I like about this is it really mimics the uh, the look and feel of XP which I like I said I, I find it just funny so anyway I just wanted to share with you just a little bit of uh, you know of how it kind of you know it looks it looks quite cool uh, the other thing that I did that I just wanted to share with you is I went ahead and pulled the uh, the sounds off my old XP machine they were wave files and then I had to convert them uh, so that I could actually have them work so let me see if I can go find my sounds here all right we go to sound effects and as you see here I went and found the Windows XP startup and uh, the shutdown so I don't, I don't know if you'll be able to hear this I'm gonna try to turn it up a little bit but here we go let's see Anyway, this is where this is where it's located. That's that's not what I was trying to do. I was trying to make the sound go off. Here we go. All right, let me see if I can get it to go. Here we go. And of course, you can have the shutdown. And so, whenever I start or stop uh, Linux Mint, I got all the sound effects that that, that uh. You know, I, I took from X, XP Windows. So anyway, I went ahead and installed a few of them. And uh, like I said, all you have to do is, what I did was I took the WAV files from Windows XP, and then I had to convert them into OGG files. And then you have to put them in... Uh, uh, user share mint artwork cinnamon sounds and so you drop them in here and basically I just use uh, I used audacity audacity is really cool you can really make some uh, uh, you can do a lot of things with audacity so that's pretty much what I did is I uh, I converted the WAV files so that Linux mint could use the file because it it wouldn't run the WAV file uh, so that had to be converted. So anyway, uh, I just did that. To uh, and of course, you know, I like the folders. I set them up to make them look kind of windowy. <laughs> Anyhow, I uh, just wanted to share that with you. Uh, I uh, I really uh, hope you enjoyed it, and uh, I guess I will. See y'all later. Uh, have a great day.